Hey, what's going on? And anything you do, there's usually more money going deeper into it rather than shallow, right? Uh, for example, someone who's been driving truck for say 20 years, they own their own truck, they're probably gonna earn more money than someone who's brand new just starting out. That's just how it is. And nearly every profession, occupation, that's just the way it is. Uh, well, it's really the same for affiliate marketing. You can actually earn a lot more money going deeper into it rather than shallow, and there's really a lot of ways you can go deep, um, and that's what I want to talk about a little bit, and, and not just go shallow. Uh, I'll give you an example. An example of going shallow with affiliate marketing is you have your Facebook page, and say you post an affiliate link uh, now and then. There's ways you can do that, get around the Facebook algorithm, and, and it's better than nothing, of course, uh, but you could probably do better if you plan ahead. Um, one, one way, there's a lot of ways you can go deep, okay? I would love to go on this topic deeper, right? <laughs> but uh, I'm just gonna stick it to one thing, and that's what's called a, a pre-sell page or a bridge page. Uh, and that's definitely one way you can go deeper into affiliate marketing and, and earn more money. So what the hell is a, a, a bridge page or this pre-sell page? Well, instead of sending someone directly to an affiliate offer, what you could do is you send that person to a pre-sell page and that would warm someone up to the idea of uh, well, owning the affiliate offer and this can help increase your income, conversions, um, and that's how that would work, okay? Now, there's a really good book. I, I read it a, a few years ago. Go call It's called Presuasion. So it's a really great book. Um, and basically, in a nutshell, uh, getting someone in the right state of mind uh, can be very helpful before you make an offer, okay? And this also works really good with negotiating. And I'll give you an example. Uh, so what you could do when you're negotiating and you're selling something, you could point to something similar. It's very, very expensive, right? Oh, that's very expensive. And here's my product, much, much less money. But because you anchored in that higher price, it makes your price much more reasonable. That's called a, it's almost like a, a, a persuasion. It's almost like a, you see where I'm going with this? Yeah, it can help you. Uh, all right. Another way uh, you can think of a, of a pre-sale is like a personal uh, endorsement of the product by yourself. You know, what are some things you really, really like about the product? You could talk about that, that in your bridge page, your pre-sale page, and that can kind of warm someone up to the idea of owning it as well. Okay, it's another uh, endorsement by you. Okay, uh, another way you can improve your pre-sale. Uh, this has to do with all your marketing. And not only, I, I read this in the book Presuasion, but I've heard from other uh, mentors that I have in affiliate marketing and copywriting, is you want to talk to the person directly, okay? Make it as personal as you can. Uh, instead of making your copy or, or your video act like you're talking to a group of people, just talk to, to one, one person, okay? And that could help you as well when it comes to persuasion. Uh, a, a third way to improve your uh, persuasion and your, uh, your pre-sale page is, uh, has to do with association, okay? Because here's the thing. We, we people, we don't like products. We don't, I don't give a shit about products. I don't care about them. We care about what the product can do for us, right? We want the outcome, the results, right? That's everything. Uh, so it's like this. I'll give you an example. Uh, it's like looking at those diamond commercials, right? You see the diamond, okay? Guys, we don't care about buying diamonds. But if, if that commercial can associate that diamond with a happy relationship, that's everything. Because we want the happy relationship. We don't care about buying a diamond. So there's an association there. So how can we, uh, as marketers, uh, do that association with our own affiliate products? In your pre-sale page, if you can associate the results, like get enthusiastic, excited about what the results could give to someone, that can warm some up someone up to the idea of owning it and that can help you um, make more sales and make more money. Um, hopefully that makes some sense there. So association is another way that you can help with your pre-sale page as well, okay? Now I really just scratched the surface um, on these bridge pages or pre-sale pages. I would love to go on this in a whole lot more detail, um, but if you want more ideas, just click on that link below or go to my website at trustthelink.com um, I go over exactly how to make a pre-sale page, uh, five different types of pre-sale pages that you can create, 
um, and a whole lot more on detail on this topic. Plus, which I'm even more excited about is I go over a lot more ideas on how to go deeper into affiliate marketing um, and earn a lot more money with less effort and time because let's be honest, you and me, we're lazy. We don't want to work, okay? We want to do other things. I want to go surfing right now, right? So I hope this video or podcast was gave you, well, it was, it was at least a little bit helpful to you. And, um, you know, I wish you the best, all right? Hey, have a great rest of your day. Bye.